just in our immediate county of the state, we've had a spike, but it's a very specific cluster. Good morning, everyone. We were just doing gym class. Uh, we missed yesterday's class because we were at the library. So we were doing this early one and we're just having a late breakfast. So I'm gonna make a nice big brunch, some eggs and stuff, and we're gonna keep on going with our day. got so much four-year-old drama going on that my head is gonna explode. He has gone from having a decent day to just exploding tonight. It's so bad. Anyway, our day is just a normal day in lockdown. We ended up doing a class up here 
first thing in the morning. Well, not first thing, when we would normally be going down for breakfast. So it was 10.15, we stayed up here late. So we can do that. We got to build a fort, so we just had some drama because I had to take it apart. Um, then we had a brunch since it was so late. We made eggs and bacon for Sebastian and egg sandwiches for Jax and I. And then I took Sebastian on our morning walk. It was very hot in midday. He was on his bike and I was just dying, pushing him up every hill in the neighborhood. It was so hot. Uh, so we cut it a little short, came back, got some work done, and boys sent off. And they're just gonna be lurking in the background until I give them vitamins. Sebastian's supposed to be changing. Well, he was in my fort with me. I, with me, I, 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 told, I told him to think before he does things, okay? Can you just read him a book or something to calm Here's him down? Him. Something calm, not like a laughing, funny ha ha one. Go read a book with brother and then we'll get you changed. Yay! You better settle down or you don't get it. Oh my gosh. Um, then they had some snacks. And we headed up for a nap. I played with Sebastian a little bit. We did nap time. Then we headed downstairs. He'd been wanting to do the perler beads. So he did some perler beads with my husband. Jax finished the puzzle and then did some perler beads. Oh, excuse me, I have hiccups. And I pulled out all of our perler bead supplies so we can work on that for a while instead of puzzles. So our dining room table is now Perler Bead Central. And I stopped after setting it up. I didn't do any tonight because I cooked dinner. Just made some spaghetti and meatballs. No meatballs for me. And then we did an af after dinner walk. Everybody but Ziggy and Jax. Jax just did. I'm lucky if I can get him to walk twice a week. And Ziggy's not good about walking around the neighborhood. He's still too reactive. So he doesn't usually get to go with us in the evening, so Jax watches him. Then we came back. I made some flower deliveries in Animal Crossing. But here we are at bedtime. Sebastian just started melting down. Maybe it's because he walked two miles with us after dinner and he's, I don't know, tired. He's not acting tired. He's acting insane. Anyway, we are we're just watching the numbers for COVID. In our area, we just had a spike of 100 positive new cases, all teenagers in our county. They all are linked to a beach week trip in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. So awesome. Thank you, teenagers. Hopefully they didn't infect tons and tons of people, but I mean, they all live at home. So the numbers are probably gonna go up around here and I just canceled our dentist appointments, which are coming up like on July, I don't know, 5th or 7th. I just called, I was like, we're just not ready for this. <laughs> and she's like, I understand. She's totally cool. I was like, I'll just get them canceled. We will have to make more appointments, but I just don't know when it's gonna be safe to be laying there with your mouth wide open and people all up in your mouth for 30 minutes at least. I'm just not ready for that. I've been trying to get myself able to like run into stores, but now I'm starting to freak out again that the numbers are gonna go back up. They're going up everywhere in the United States. And ah, uh, guys, this is not good. It's not good. Anyway, tomorrow we desperately need to go to the library and pick up holds. Yes, we were just there yesterday. But I just gave Jax access to his library card via the website. Like, he already was using his card for his books that I share with Sebastian, unless we just need overflow. But right now our cards have been bumped up to 100 books each. They had dropped it down to 70 when we were all sharing and I had to get a second card. So one for Jax so that we could fit all our books because 50 was not enough for the three of us. So yeah, he has access to log onto the online catalog and reserve holds. And so many came in today. <laughs> He's 
I've messaged them enough times like you might want to stop for now because you've got a lot of books coming in. And then I come down from that and he says, oh, so I added one more. I couldn't resist. So I need to log into his account and see what's going on, how many are waiting for us. But we're going to go and get them. We'll do the pull-up thing if we can, like drive up. If there's none in the morning, I might just run in and get them because I would rather get them in the morning and do a walk through the forest that's near there. Because it was just really shady and cool and it's just gonna be July. It's gonna be July here all week long. So that might be a nice walk. I can usually convince Jax to come if I buy them Starbucks. I might have to say no to the Frappuccinos. They can't have a Frappuccino once a week if we're starting to do this walk more often. But yeah, maybe I'll get them all out of the house that way and aim to do it a little bit earlier in the morning. That would be nice and get the library books. And then get back so that we can watch Siggy for nap time. Anyway, that is my story and I'm sticking to it. I am so thankful for you guys watching all the way through. Thank you so much. I love when you guys comment. Let me know how the virus is doing in your area, if things are opened back up and the numbers are staying stable or low, or if you are in a zone where things are spiking. Virginia is not spiking and they're going ahead with some opening, I think, tomorrow. I even heard that our pool is opening on Monday, but with we'll talk tomorrow about all that, but we won't be going. It's, it's a whole nother thing and I'll be here too long. But yeah, let me know how your area is. Just in our immediate county of the state, we've had a spike, but it's a very specific cluster. So hopefully it's just that and we continue like, but our numbers were like this, do, 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 and then we opened up and now it's kind of like this. And so if that spike, it could, it could make us go back up because we're not going down. But that's how it is here. Let me know how it is there. Good night, guys. Stay happy and healthy and safe. And don't forget, you really need to wash your hands.